the racist and homophobic people that you perform for. Yeah, they'll let you sit at the table to listen to you bash the people that they hate, but they will never let you eat. Hi, Candace Owens. You see, I'm not usually one to rub things into people's faces when I'm right and say I told you so. But you once suggested that women shouldn't vote, so I told you so. For years, The Daily Wire gave you a platform and paid you to say some of the most racist, homophobic, transphobic, misogynistic things. They celebrated you for it. You were their darling. You thought you were a part of the club. Just one of the boys. You bragged about how excited you were to be on a platform where you couldn't get canceled because that's a left thing. You were able to speak freely. And then you got canceled by them because you forgot the number one rule, Candace. Like I said, they will let you sit at the table to bash the people that they hate, but they will never let you eat. You helped push their message, their narrative, and then they discarded you like trash. And I know you're going to pull the whole Tucker Carlson thing when he got fired from Fox. And you're going to say, I'm finally free to speak on the truth and what I really want to say. But you collected those checks. You said you knew there were certain topics you couldn't come out and talk about. That you've known this for years. So much for speaking your truth, right? I agree with you when you say what's happening to the Palestinian people right now is wrong. But I'm not going to applaud you for saying the sky is blue. There's people that are going to say even a broken clock is right twice a day. But for me, you're still a broken clock. And I can't look past the harm that you have caused so many marginalized groups. Maybe I'm a little less forgiving. That's my problem. Because the rhetoric that you've spewed over the years has helped legislation get passed, bans to happen, reverse progress that we have made towards change. And you did it for a check. And you've hurt so many people along the way. You're not a martyr now, Candace. And I'm not coming on here to tell people how to feel about you now. This is my personal opinion. But I am coming on here to tell you, I told you so. They put you on a pedestal when you were trashing black people, right? All the way up there. And now you've been knocked off your pedestal. I'm sure you're going to rebrand You've done it in the past. You were once a liberal commentator and then you got mad at the left because something went down with your website. So you became this right wing extremist conservative. So I don't really know what you're going to rebrand to now. You're accepting donations. So I guess whoever the highest donor is, but I don't, I'm not going to buy the redemption tour. You hurt too many people along the way for money and for the people up top. And what'd they do for you? I guess you can say, they said, bye.